Hey, how's it going? Alex here from Idea Spot, and today we are back with another WooCommerce tutorial. Today we are going to be covering print on demand. So I've got a Printful tutorial. So Printful is a service that will let you take a design, put it on a product of your choice, and put that product into your WordPress WooCommerce store. So we're going to have a full tutorial where we take a design, put it onto a product, and put the product into our own WooCommerce store. So if that sounds good, stick around. Uh, Printful will let you print onto so many different products, clothing, posters, phone cases, hats, pillows, uh, aprons and bean bags, even some jewelry there. So I think we might stick with mugs for now. You can get a really nice uh, design that you make or someone else makes, put it on your um, printful design and um, away you go. You can put those in your products on your own store. Uh, last time we made one on um, AliExpress, but today we're going to make our own design, put it onto a mug and sell them in our store. And you can sell items without ever having to carry any inventory, ever having to touch the item. Um, Printful will um, print and ship them out to your customers. All you have to do is run your store and design your items. So let's get started. You head over to Printful. All you have to do is sign up. So just go um, printful.com and sign up. You'll get a, a typical sign up form. You don't need anything special to get started. Just name, email, password, and then um, you'll get a um, confirmation email. Head over to your email, go ahead and um, confirm your email address there. Awesome. So that's all successful. Um, we can get started now. So first thing we will want to do is connect a store. Just go over to the stores option there. Let's open that up in another tab. Um, there's so many different formats of stores you can use with uh, Printful, but today we are going to be looking at WooCommerce. Um, just go ahead, click connect, and it'll give you um, some instructions. So you can set up for an existing store. Um, all we have to do is follow these directions. So let's get started on that. So first thing we do, we have to enable the REST API in WooCommerce settings. So that is under WooCommerce settings advanced. So let's go to our dashboard. We head to WooCommerce under settings, click the advanced tab, click the REST API, and then wait for that to load up. And we just have to enable the legacy API. Legacy API is there and enable the legacy REST API. Hit save changes. So that's going to say your settings have been saved. Let's go over and check the next step. Uh, make sure that the permalink settings are not set to plain. So let's go and check our permalink settings. That is under settings and permalinks. So in here, we've got our settings checked on post name. So that's fine. They just want to make sure that you're not using plain permalinks, which is you should never do. Um, never use plain permalinks. Always use post name or a custom structure, perhaps. Um, that's all good. Okay, so just make sure you've got that post name or custom structure permalink set up and click Save Changes. And now you can check if it's working. So you just need to go to that URL that they've said there, but you just need to replace that yoursitehere.com with your own domain. So let's see if we can do that, shall we? Let's paste that in. And I'm working on this demo domain for Ideaspot. So I'll just copy that and replace it in here. There we go. Now let's see if that's working. So I don't get too scared here. Um, you just have to have a look at this code and see. Here we've got my store name and here we've got the website address. So it all looks like the code has been set up properly. That's all they're saying in the instructions there. See if it contains code with your site information. So that looks like it's all working just fine. So the next step is to install the Printful plugin. Just head over to your plugin section in the dashboard, add a new plugin, and we're going to search for the Printful plugin. That should pop up. There it is. Hit install now, and then click activate when that is ready. Great. So after you activate the Printful plugin, you'll get your Printful plugin on your dashboard. Go ahead and click that, and you'll get a chance to connect to Printful. So let's hit connect. Here we go. And it's just a matter of connecting WooCommerce to Printful, and that will ask you to approve it. Go ahead and do it. There we go. And it will say connect to an existing account. That was the one we signed up with. So just click sign in there. 
and confirm connection. Let's connect to that Printful shop. And here we go. Our data is being synchronized with Printful. Awesome. Now that'll just take a few seconds and then our WooCommerce store is linked to Printful and now we can start adding products to our store. Okay, so we just click add product and we're going to do a coffee mug. Let's go to home and living and coffee mugs. Let's just stick with the plain white mug and let's go ahead and upload our logo here. Just go ahead and drop your logo onto the mug. Now with a mug, you don't necessarily want the design to be on the center of the mug like you would with a t-shirt or something. You probably want um, something on one side of the mug and something on the other side. So for this one, let's put the mug um, for a right-hander. You'll see the mug uh, with the logo on the middle of the mug there. And you could put a different design on the other side of the mug, which might be nice. But let's just duplicate this on both sides of the mug for now, for this demonstration at least. Um, for the 15-ounce mug, same thing. Let's make it smaller and duplicate. There we go. So you can actually click mock up view and you'll see what this will look like on your mug. So there we go. You get, um, you get some nice little plain product images. You get some lifestyle looking things and you get, even get a model holding your mug. So with Printful, really easy to market. That's all done for you. Um, and let's go proceed to mockups. So I really like those lifestyle mockups. I'd like that to be my main image. And let's stick with the 11 ounce one as our main image and stick with JPEG. It's a little bit more efficient and proceed to description. We're going to call it the idea spot mug. You can edit this description, but I'm just going to leave it default for the demo and proceed to pricing. So for our 11 ounce mug, it's going to be $7.95 from Printful. We're going to charge 11 in the store and make $3 profit. So you can set that to whatever you like. You can make them both $14.95 maybe. Let's do that. And so you'd make $7 on the small one, $4 on the on the large one. Let's let's bump it up. Make it let's make it uh, $19.95 for the big one. There we go. So we make a similar profit each way. Um, we do want to publish the product and we want to put it in the mugs category. So your categories will automatically import into here. So let's submit it to the store and that's going to start generating and uploading to our store. So let's wait for that to finish. So there we go. That's all been imported into our store. We can actually click view in WooCommerce and with any luck, we've got a nice mug available in our store. So how easy is that? We get a beautiful mug beautiful images already made. Um, you can set your price, your customer can choose their option and that's all done automatically. So um, we're pretty much done. You just need to set up a billing method. So um, when your customer buys one, uh, Printful will bill your PayPal or your credit card and your customer will pay you through your checkout. Um, so just either put in a credit card here or link it up with your PayPal. That's probably easier. You just log in with PayPal there and um, link up your PayPal business with Printful. And then it will automatically order the product from Printful, ship it directly to your customer. You'll be able to sell these straight to your customers without ever having to deal with any inventory. It's all automated. Even your shipping calculations are done automatically. I'll just cover that quickly as well. It's under um, your dashboard. You go to WooCommerce settings and it's under the shipping tab. And with the Printful plugin, you'll get this Printful shipping option. So click that and make sure the Printful shipping is enabled. Hit save. Um, and now when you go ahead and add these to cart, you will get the... Um, the Printful shipping calculation done. So there we go. You can have um, flat rate shipping $6.99. So um, fairly reasonable. And they cover most of the um, the world with the shipping. There's a few in Africa and Middle East that aren't covered. But um, the United States, only three or four days shipping. And Europe, only three or four, three to five days. So um, very um, convenient to have all that done automatically. So that pretty much wraps it up. Uh, I hope you enjoyed learning how to um, design your own products and sell them straight from your store with your own designs printed straight onto them. You can do shirts and gifts and all kinds of things. So if that was helpful, make sure you hit like, 
hit subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. In our next video, we're going to cover how to tidy up this page a little bit. You'll notice I've taken out the breadcrumbs up the top there, the um, descriptions and the uh, um, the additional tabs there. I've turned all those off. So um, if you want to learn how to clean this page up a little bit, make it a bit tidier, um, make sure you hit subscribe and we'll cover that in the next video. I'll see you next time.